uh, you'll find a lot of people you know taking pictures and putting it on twitter and facebook when the generation of social media and the pictures go everywhere so everybody does want to be well turned out that doesn't mean you have to go out with you know cakes of makeup or layers or anything like that but everybody does want to look good on a daily basis and also a lot of people for job interviews are looking for people who do speak well are well turned out well groomed i think a little more emphasis uh, in today's generation on uh, on looks for sure a lot of people think the moment you are saying wearing a suit and saying okay what young india wants i'll talk about something very deep and like social issues equality corruption justice things like that but i'm going to be honest today and tell you what i think young india wants based on my experiences but what young india wants is basically a good job and a really good girlfriend or boyfriend that's really what most people want of course i like to say they want a better country and cleaner system that meri naukri and meri chokri is the biggest driver I think girls today are far more aware of their surroundings of what they want to be, who they want to be. And they're not easily fooled. Uh, I think to begin with, they know they're more practical about what they want in life. I mean, chasing your dream is great. Being determined, focused, hard work is great. One thing about Shetan Bhai is that he writes very simply, and he's telling you a very coherent story, and he speaks in an English that Indian speak. So he's not he doesn't, doesn't indulge himself. He's actually engaging the reader, telling them a story uh, clearly and, and efficient. This is why the youth has not had power. It is also because the people in power are very possessive about it. So still today, there is no path to politics for an ordinary person. An ordinary person cannot, very rarely, can join politics and make it. No matter how good he or she is, either you have to be super connected or you have to be born into a family. it is not good you know it's not good for the profession it's not good for india's future so all that needs to change and the youth will demand this and if we collectively demand this then the parties will reform things like that so that common agenda of the youth needs to be created that we all agree with